Good day, mates. I'm Flinty, and this week you're joining me to find out 10 amazing facts about the pop band Blink 182 that you didn't even know. So listen up, and you might learn a thing or two. So on to fact number one about the band. The band's original gimmick was that each song would have exactly 182 drum beats and 182 guitar strokes for each song exactly. It's a shame that the songs weren't limited to 182 words as well, but unfortunately the longest one of their songs has 97 words. Fig number two that you didn't even know. Did you know? that in 1998 the band set up a giant net above the audience that when released would let down a flurry of pepper onto the crowd sparking an avalanche of sneezes. During the band's very good encore performance a giant net above the audience was released and it let down a flurry of pepper onto the crowd sparking an avalanche of sneezes. An artifact three that you didn't even know about the band. Did you know that the word gunshot appears in the lyrics to every single one of the band's songs? When the day comes that they decide to leave out the word gunshot, I bet fans would leave the band's live shows like a gunshot. On to fact number four. Did you know? That before Blink-182 came along, there was no such thing as a left-handed drumstick. Along came the diva-like whining of their drummer, who demanded to have left-handed drumsticks made, or he wouldn't drum at all. So they were invented, and he continues to play shows with the band. Fact number five about the band that you didn't even know. The band hadn't even started their career yet, when the thrashing beats of Matt Berry and the Maypoles bashed their ears over the airwaves. That was enough for Blink-182 to decide to start Blink-182, a band that would become even more popular than Matt Berry and the Maypoles. Fig number six. Before each live show, known as a gig to people in the scene, the members of Blink-182 hold an antiques fair in the venue for an hour or so, buying and trading rare antiques with the public to earn a few bucks on the side. That would explain one of the band's original names that I'm about to explain to you. On to fact number seven, the band's original names. Before they were known as Blink-182, the band had two other names that you didn't even know that didn't catch on so well. At first, they were called the Love Joys to celebrate their love of antiques, and second, they were called Sum 182. They later changed the name to Blink 182, and that's what they're called now. Fig number eight. Even though the band is famous for throwing live rabbits into the audience during shows, their favorite farmyard pest is actually the fox. They just love the way its ears prick up when it hears nearby predators and the way that they burrow into the ground to keep warm in the winter months. Good going, you little fox. On to fact nine that you didn't even know about the band Blink-182. Everyone knows that the band is famous for its use of ventilators. They're used at live shows and even during the recording process making their albums. But did you know that punk rock drummer Marky Ramone was the one who introduced ventilators to the band? Now where would they be without their ventilators? In fact number 10 about the band Blink-182 that you probably didn't even know. Many Blink-182 fans cite that their favourite band is the best in the pop-punk world. What they don't know is that they're completely wrong. That accolade goes to the band Giant Eagles. Well, thank you ever so much for checking out my facts about the band. I hope you've learned a thing or two and have come away from this knowing just a little more about this world. 
don't forget to come back next week. I'm going to have a few more facts for you. I wonder what I would have dug up next time. All the best, guys. Have a nice week.